Two cool and refreshing salads, each with a twist, as we are cooking up a storm with meteorologist Jacob Dickey. We started with a uh, broccoli salad, which has some peanut butter, amongst other things in it, but I don't want to run out of time before we find out what the twist is to the watermelon. That's right. This watermelon is another great fun side dish. You have this for the kids here. You'll end up with a bowl and a half of this when you cut a watermelon in the summertime. So this is a unique way to have a twist on it. So what I've got is in my bowl here is I've put in some watermelon. We're going to put a splash of olive oil in there and uh, just kind of pour that. And it's going to be tossed with that just a little bit here. The other thing I've done is I've made my own sauce here. This is a uh, sauce and it's a very unique sauce actually. It's got a little bit of a, this is more of a Thai inspired dish. What I've done with this is I've put some lime juice, some fish sauce, and some sugar. When I say fish sauce, I mean fish sauce. So that's the twist. Yeah, it is. It's, you know, you kind of think fish and watermelon? Would not have expected going on? at all. But when you see it come together, you're really going to see how it's inspired by uh, some Thai cooking here. So I'm going to take my sauce that I've mixed up in my mason jar and just pour it on top of that with the oil there. And the flavor really is going to come out here, that lime and the watermelon, a great complement to each other here. So we've got it in there. Let's just toss it a little bit, just toss it lightly. And uh, we'll just get that so it's nice and evenly mixed. There'll be some juice in the bottom. That's totally fine here. We just want to coat it uh, as far as our pan goes. And once that's done, then we're ready to pour it out onto the plate here. So I'm going to slide it out so I can get it. And it will be ready to roll. There's extra juice in the bottom. Again, don't worry about that. It's coated. It's fine. I'm going to have more in there. I can save that and throw in another batch if I want. And there we have our watermelon. Now we're going to put a little basil on it, a little topping there. Okay. Now, we have almost finished both of them. There's another you little say twist. almost? What's, what's left? There's always a twist. With okay. both of these here, there's one last thing to top this with. On my broccoli salad, to give it a little extra pop, I'm going to put some tart cherries on there. A little cherry on top. I like it. And it's exactly right. And uh, so that's going to be a nice flavor. And then on my watermelon, what we're going to do is we're actually going to add some dried roasted peanuts on there. And that's going to top it. And you can kind of tell how you get that Thai-inspired idea with that, can't Absolutely, you? Absolutely, yeah. So it'll be really delicious and ready to roll. And this is what we're left with here. So uh, I think we've got a minute left or so. Is that about right? We're a little less than that. A little less. I'm going to get a plate here with a couple, a couple of little bites on there. And you can try this. All right. I'm going to try And see what you say. And I'm sure it's going to be good, but I will confirm. I will try the water. You tried the watermelon first. Is that right? I did. You can go to CIliving.tv for the recipes. I'm going to continue to, uh, to eat right here. What's the final oh, word? Man. Good? Delicious? Oh, good. Perfect. Glad to hear it.